Grace, mercy, and peace may be multiplied unto you. This is Apostle Elliot to some, Dr. Elliot to others. I want to take a moment of time to give a word of revelation, clarification, or foundation regarding a name or a character that is referenced in the Bible. And the name that I'm referring to is Timothy. Uh, when we turn to 1 Timothy chapter 1, verse 2, the scripture reads, Unto Timothy, my own son in the faith. And this is the Apostle Paul speaking uh, to his spiritual son in ministry or in the faith named Timothy. The scripture says, Grace, mercy, and peace from God our Father in Jesus Christ our Lord. So there is a salutation that is given to this individual. And in, in citing this individual's name here in the scripture, not only do we find it written in our English language in the New Testament as Timothy, uh, when we look in the book of Acts and Romans and 1st and 2nd Corinthians, Philippians and Colossians, we will also find it written as Timotheus. So this one name, Timothy, is also uh, a variation of the name Timotheus, and it may also be a variation of the enunciation Timetheos. And the reason I say that is because when we begin to look at the name from the Greek dialect, it is composed of two words, tiny and theos. And when you look at the word tiny, T-I-M-E, that is spelled the same way that we spell time, um, the definition for tiny in the Greek is uh, to value or to add honor by which a price is fixed or a price is set. It also means the price that is paid or received for a person, place, or thing which one uh, buys or that is sold to someone. Now, in conjunction with that, when we look at this word timey, because once again, it's talking about valuing something by paying a price for it. The root to timey is tino, T-I-N-O. And what's very profound is it enunciates what the payment is. When we look at that word tino, it means to suffer punishment or a penalty as the payment. So then tiny is really implying a uh, suffering punishment or the penalty as a payment of value towards something or someone. This becomes the fixed or set price of payment for something or someone. Well, who that something or someone is, is the Lord God or his divine essence or his entity because the second part of the word Timotheus or Timotheos is theos, which means uh, once again, not only God, but it means deity or the divine or divinity. So then when those two words, tiny and theos are put together to uh, produce the name Timotheus or Timetheos or Timothy, it means to honor God or to value the divine based on one's punishment or price being paid that's fixed in order to be what that honoring is defined as towards the Lord God or the divineness or divinity. So in that, I pray this has just been a profound word of revelation, clarity, and understanding, not only of the name Timothy or Timotheus or Timotheus, but that it also is information that will bless you as you continue in your divine destiny in the Lord God through Christ Jesus and Christ Jesus alone, especially as in our destiny, we continue to pay the price that is necessary to obtain the divineness in eternity with Christ. And with that being said, amen, 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 and may blessings be unto you.